Okay, I rewound this microwave oven transformer. It puts out about 12 volts, actually. Let's quick find out. So I don't remember. I think it was like 12 or something. So there's my multimeter. Again. Yeah, 12.4. After it's rectified and smoothed out, it should be a little higher, but... Yeah. That's going to be the power supply for my flyback. I have new wires wound on to the ferrite core, and I found the HV negative right there. So, should, just got to order some stuff from DigiKey now. Okay, I just hooked up a little 2 amp rectifier here to see what kind of voltage I'll be getting out, and then I have a big capacitor on there. It's 470 microfarads at 200 volts. That's awfully big, but that's what I'll be using probably. So there's my multimeter hooked up. So let's plug it in. See what we get. So it starts off up high, then it starts dropping probably as the capacitor charges up. You might put a smaller one on there, or at least a smaller voltage rating. So it originally had about 12 volts AC, now it's giving me about 20 volts DC. And this is without a load, I don't know if it'll drop with a load, but... So, there we go. Okay, you can see I've put a smaller capacitor on here. At this time it's a 2200 microfarad at 35 volts instead of 470 at 200, because I don't need the 200 volt one. And when I turn it on, it stabilizes around 17.6 once it charges up. So, that's, I think, about what the final output power of this is going to be. Well, um, I accidentally shorted it out, and I let the, all the magic smoke out of the rectifier, so... I wasn't going to use this one anyway, but still, it's a perfectly good 2 amp one. Oh well, and it blew up too, so at least it was kind of cool.